Have you ever had a best friend and you guys gotten so close, so, so close that one of the exes pops up into her life again? You get a little jealous. Not because you want your best friend, but because, hold up, I'm the one you're close to now. You don't gotta go backwards to your ex. You don't need that person. I'm the person to be in your life right now. Fuck your ex. Well, in my case, no, I've never been in that type of situation, never been in those type of shoes. I have never been jealous of my best friend's relationship with anybody, <laughs> period, point blank. Some people do get jealous and it's understandable. I get it. So here we go, Easy and Natalie. These girls are best friends to the point where people even think that they should be together. I don't think so. I believe that they're soulmates, most definitely, and not in a relationship aspect, more of best friends. I believe their spirits connect. This video that Easy and Natalie came out with is called Introducing My Ex to My Best Friend and then in parentheses, bad idea. I guess Natalie is gonna bring her ex around and Easy is gonna meet him. In case y'all haven't been caught up, Natalie is straight, Easy is a lesbian stud and they are just friends. So let's go ahead and react to this video. Today I am going to be introducing my best friend to my ex. I'm mm. not trying to act like I'm jealous or anything, but yo, Natalie and Frank are a little booed up, and I just, y'all gotta see it from my perspective. You wanna start <laughs> in? I mean, uh, Frank, oh my god, what do you want me to call you, Frank or Rude? Call me what you need to call me. How straight am I gonna go? Uh, straight than me. She's on top oh, of him. Oh my god, are you serious? Shut the fuck up. <laughs> What's up, me? What? What up? What up? What up? Guys, today is going to be a very interesting day, to say the least. Today, oh, no. I am going to be introducing my best friend to my ex. And she has no idea yet. So, oh, shit. I just told her we were going to be vlogging and stuff. Um, we're going to be going to the mall and stuff like that. But I'm having him meet us there. And I'm probably going to tell her when we're already on our way there that he's gonna be beating us. This is gonna be oh, very interesting. No. She's never met anyone that I've dated before. See? So let's see how this goes. Wait. I don't know how long they've been friends. I, I, I know at least two years. It's gotta be at least two years. But they've gotten so close. It seems like they've known each other for about 10 plus years. So this is gonna be interesting. Wish me luck. But if you're new to this channel, make sure you guys subscribe, turn your post notifications on, and give this video a big thumbs up. And make sure you watch this video to the end because you never know if we're going to be doing a giveaway in this video. And please watch those ads because it helps us to bring you quality content on a regular basis. Okay. Let's get into it. Promote, girl. Thanks, <laughs> yeah, I mean, sure, I'm ready to get some drip. You know, I need some shoes and I need a jacket. I need, I definitely need a jacket. Girl, you got a million pairs of shoes and a million jackets. You don't need no more. <laughs> you know, like, I don't know what it is, but, like, I'm so obsessed with... I love how easy dresses. I wish... Well, I don't know. I think if I had the money to go out shopping, I think I'll have a better wardrobe. But I don't right now, but maybe eventually I will. But her t-shirt, I can't tell by the seatbelts, but I think that's Aaliyah. And she was my favorite artist in my teenage years. My absolute favorite. Bags and jackets. So I feel like at the mall, like once I get there, it's just like, oh god, I gotta buy a jacket, gotta buy a bag. Oh my god, help her! You need retail therapy. <laughs> retail therapy. Comes up with this stuff. Um, so I thought we would like switch it up a little bit. Um, you know, kids, uh -oh. we want to give our fans a little more personal taste of ourselves. Oh no. Um, instead of just vlogging the mall, like actually inviting a friend to come, like vlog with us. Oh, oh, oh. um, Frank. My stepdad? No. What the heck? Don't you think I'll tell you if your stepdad or something? <laughs> well, what other freak? I'm like. <laughs> no, um, I think you know about rude gentlemen. Rude gentlemen. Rude gentlemen. What's that? Yeah. What? That's so random. I know that's her ex and everything, but how, why rude gentlemen? Why is that his name, aka? Do not hang out with him. Well, you don't hang out with him. I used to hang out with him all the time when I first moved. Wait, what? Wait, you guys were dating? Yeah. It when? What? 
So is this guy like a YouTuber or something or an Instagram model or who is he? He obviously is somebody that she would know without knowing that they dated. Hmm. Do y'all know who that is? Comment below. Oh, wait, hold, hold the phone. What? Yeah, I mean, I never really told you because it was just like, it wasn't a big deal. Like, we just, mm -mm. We, we talked for a very brief moment. We decided to focus on our careers. And we, you know, we were just like, the, the passion wasn't there between us. So. Oh, so it was just like, you know, when you first move out here, you meet somebody. Exactly. And, like, and they're like, oh, they're cute. And you kind of talk to them. And you're like, nah, not for me. Yeah. yeah, it was like that. So it's literally, we have never, like, it's just going to be on some friend stuff. It's only been, okay. we've only been friends since then. So three years ago is what she's saying. So yeah, they've known each other for two years or so. Okay guys, so we are at the mall now. Yeah. Where are we supposed to be meeting him at? Um, I think that's him right there. Isn't it? Oh my god, I'm nervous. Frank! Hey! Oh, can you hold this? Oh, I haven't seen him forever. She runs to his ass. Easy catch up. Oh, hell no. She straddled him. She should have straddled him. Okay. What up, bro? Mine, by the way. Oh, my. Oh, y'all miss each other, miss each other. Oh, damn. Okay. I know. All right, well, all right then. Y'all good? Yeah. What's up? I'm just. Y'all touching feet, so no, we literally haven't seen each other since like forever, right? It's been like a Oh my god, he's walking yeah. behind her and everything. Y'all do look at a couple. Right, right. We can have the phone. Hey. Bro, calm down. I look I look green, it's for everybody. It's for everybody. Oh, they are wearing the same color. Oh, this is a good vlog. Oh yeah, it's gonna it's gonna be good. Come on. Do you see that? You don't see that? Hold on. Now, I, look, I look green. It's for everybody. It's for everybody. All right, so we're going to make sure this is a good vlog. Oh, yeah. It's going gonna, it's gonna to be good. Come on. Let's go. Ooh, oh, yeah. Wow, we see each other. You can see Yo, the jealousy in her eyes. Hey. You can see the jealousy in her eyes. Oh, my God. Here we go. Oh, you have Shit, like what? The Trump Awards? Yo, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, the I red carpet. You know, the red carpet looking fresh. Yeah. He's handsome. He's a good looking guy. Okay. Alright, Natalie. Might have to give him a second chance there. I didn't see y'all at the after party though. Oh, it was after party? Yeah. Like, did y'all get your, the best tickets? You know what I'm saying? The VIP truck? Oh. Oh, no. Nah, remember, we went, where did we go after Natalie and Trumpet Awards? I had Trumpet Economy. She had Trumpet Economy. Hey, you already know I went to have you stuff. up. You know what I'm saying? Damn. Like, that was the last time I went to Trumpet Awards. Come on, Eve. Step, step your game up, Eve. Step your game up. Why did you text me? Oh, I should have been up there with you. You should have. Could you have brought both of us or not? Mm, I mean, I'm like, I don't know. I think you could have brought us first and foremost. Secondly, I didn't know there was an after party. That's so You wouldn't know. <laughs> Damn. You know, but seriously, guys, like, Frank is literally the plug. Like, he knows about everything. You know. Like, literally, when we used to go out together, we would be at the best places. Like, I've had the most fun with him that I've ever had in Hell my yeah. life, right? Hell yeah. Like, what about you? We yeah. have. Y'all be having the most fun? Hell yeah, that's my best friend. We always have a friend. That's my best friend. We be having fun. Be having fun like that. We be, we be having, having fun. Me and E be having fun, guys. But it's like, it's a little different. Damn. <laughs> She had to put that butt in there. She said, me and E be having fun, guys, but it'd be different. <laughs> Damn, Natalie, like that. Because I kind of experienced, like, new stuff with him, like, that I've never got to see in my life. Oh. You know what I mean? Wait a minute, hold on now. I took you to Thailand. Mm. Oh, she right. She did take me to Thailand. Ah. We, were, we didn't get that far, huh? You didn't even take her to another country. What you gonna say next? What you gonna say next? Our relationship, we were planning trips. We Wait, didn't get there. I thought y'all, like... They, like, you know, like, oh, no, yeah, it was getting pretty real. It was kind of serious. It was getting pretty real. Wait, I, I like, literally said in the car and it wasn't that serious. Yeah. I, you I didn't mean, mean that, dude. <laughs> Damn. She literally said in the car, like, y'all had like a little mini thing. Easy, stop it. Now you're instigating. Now you want, you want them to fight. So you had to put her on blast like that. You didn't have to do all that. <laughs> I was talking, but it wasn't like serious. I don't want nothing many over here. <laughs> Why? I don't want nothing many over here. <laughs> she knew what it was. She knew what it was. She knew what it was. But no, guys. If, so I guess if we weren't like in a relationship, relationship. Did, look. <laughs> Never 
rewind that back and let me show you guys a view real quick. A bird's, a bird's eye view. Hold on. Look at that. That's so sad. This is why I don't go out with a couple. I just don't. If you're going to be hanging out with a couple, you got to bring your partner too. Okay? And she was going to bring her ex. You should have gave Easy a heads up so she can bring her ex too. Fuck it. Why not? Because look at this. You guys are leaving her behind. She looks lonely. You guys are at a mall. You guys look coupled up. And a little old Easy all, all lonely by herself. Y'all are bogus. She knew what it was. She knew what it was. But no, guys. It, so I guess if we weren't like in a relationship, relationship so kind of. in a vlog or what? Like, are we For real. Vlog? What happened? You okay. interrupted. I thought this channel was called Easy and Natalie. I was trying to. You was trying to what? Let's make sure this isn't a date. What's going on YouTube? Yeah. yeah. This is YouTube for our YouTube channel. You got a YouTube channel? Um, eventually, I'm gonna get one. Okay, cool. We got a best friend channel. That shit we can help you grow yours if you want. Right. You could be like in more of our videos. Shit, we should do one. Yeah. You want to do one? You want to? Well, yeah, it's a yeah. best friend page. Rude and Natalie. Yeah. Oh, that Ooh. one is so cool. That shit dope. Hell yeah. Tell me. Uh, what's <laughs> up, Rude? Wait, what would we say? Rude and Natalie game? I mean, like, I don't know. Uh, I don't know. Who's that? Y'all being rude, Natalie. <laughs> 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 Straight up. I'm being rude, Natalie. Yeah. <laughs> right, we'll come up with something. All right. <laughs> Wait, it's giveaway time. Okay, guys, today's. All right, they're giving a giveaway, and we're not going to participate in that because I don't want shit. So we're going to go ahead and fast forward. Are we chilling? We're just catching up. I'm doing a lot of catching up over here. What do you mean? I've been working out. Damn, yeah. Working out okay, so Don't let's go mean. to the juice spot. You know, our favorite, ju our favorite juice spot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go okay. to our juice spot. So we're going to go to our juice spot right now, guys. Yeah, get some yeah, juice. Get some juice. If y'all don't know. Damn, juice. What? what is it? It's good. Hold on. First of all, we're both Natalie. We love this place. It's called, what is it called? Um, what is it called? I don't know. Damn. Like healthy juice spot? No, no, no. It's actually, they got some healthy stuff, but it's like it's real sweet. deal, like sweet and fruity. You know? Sweet, yeah, you know. Like you. Exactly <laughs> like me. Exactly like and, me. And there's you nothing know? wrong with that. Right. Yeah, you already know. Yeah, you know. Oh God. Exactly. Hold on now. Don't let me bust out the muscles, cause I'm strong you ain't got too. No muscles. You ain't got no All right. Muscles. He, he gonna he gonna test me, y'all. He test me. Okay, guys. So we're at the juice spot. Oh wait, she said babe at first. <laughs> oh my god. And he's over here saying call me what you're used to call me. I can call you that. <laughs> <laughs> I cannot call you that. Guys, he's such a fool. Oh uh, what? Why you just get two? Why you just get two? Bro, get your own. <laughs> she hates it. Oh, she hate it. Yeah. Bro, get your boy. Okay, guys. All right. So wait, what, what are we ordering? We're about to order. We're about right to now. order. We can get these. What's this size right here? Uh, twenty-four. All right, twenty-four ounces. We get twenty-four ounces. We're gonna get uh, what? Two twenty-four ounces. Nah, I'm good. I don't need that much. Let me just get some uh, let me get the banana, the strawberry. Yeah, it's my favorite. You know, my favorite favorite. Yeah. Yeah, I do that. It hurts, basically. All right, what do you think I should get? Get the good one. I don't know, I don't know about the juice. Okay, um, I'm gonna do the biscuits one, I think. How much is that again? Okay, guys. Oh, this guy. Oh, I hate when people do that. I hate when people do that. When you know exactly what they're trying to do. He had to be Superman. He had to be the superhero. To come save everyone's lives, right? He had to be Mr. M Mr. Macho Man and step up to the plate. He came out with his card and was like, "I got it." This guy, come on now, just let that, just let Easy pay. Let, let the man handle it. She don't never pitch no one on here. I got it. Damn. Okay. Well. Mm. Okay. And I. Oh. Guys. 
like seriously I don't know I think it's starting to get awkward like easy is getting upset they're like competing like what you say? I said that the three of you are beautiful and then when I saw her I was like wow that's the most beautiful girl I've ever seen in my life oh, oh my goodness oh Natalie thank you She's a I. She's a I. She's so cute. So <laughs> we come here all the time. Yeah, all the time. Heck yeah. Yo, tell y'all, y'all gotta try this. You guys must have tipped her. Just saying. It's the... Oh shit, it's... it's... <laughs> well damn! Alright, yep. Yeah. Mm. Mm -hmm. What, what, what? No, I don't need to try it. Like, Ooh, this is bomb. Try mine. I don't really want to. It's like, I'm not in the mood for creamy, you know? Y'all right. doing the most right now, for real, for real. She's not in the mood for creamy. Yeah. All right, y'all. So, I'm not trying to act like all jealous or anything, but yo. But you are. Me and Frank are a little booed up, and I just, y'all gotta see it from my perspective. I see it. I see it. And I would not be comfortable at all. And it doesn't even have to deal with wanting her attention it's not that it's the fact that you are the third wheel girl and you didn't even plan this you knew nothing about this so she didn't even give you a heads up till you were on your way to the mall i'd be pissed i'd be annoyed aggravated frustrated ready to go home i'm surprised you're still there with them and vlogging at that you feel me like look at them is there something going on that i don't know about uh -uh. they are definitely they're definitely more than just like oh we talk at a certain point you feel me i would have felt like i was the chauffeur i would have felt like natalie just wanted me to take her to drive her to the mall because that's the situation right now they just left her behind but she look at this y'all what's up y'all y'all see some shoes Oh yeah, there's some like cute shoes, come on. And you have to understand too that Easy has never seen her with another man like this, okay? So this is the, I'm thinking this is like one of the first times that she's seen her be affectionate with somebody. So that's a little awkward to begin with. It's a little bit uncomfortable and easy. Or the case may also be is that Easy might have some hidden feelings for Natalie. It might, it might possibly be. Think about it. Natalie hasn't been dating anyone since they've been friends. And they're real close, so who knows? Hmm, we might be getting on to something. Which ones? Look at these. You oh. said you can see me in these though. Oh yeah, those are nice. I, I like these a lot. You should get these. How much are these? Um, one, two. One, Don't offer to pay. One, two. One, two. Yeah, one, two. Don't offer to pay. You think that's a lot? I mean, for these, yeah, I think it's a lot. They're Adidas. These are not a lot. <laughs> I'm talking about, about pair for everybody. Oh, oh so you just ball like that. You ball the ball. Yeah. You feel yeah, so good. Ooh, you like that? Yeah, what is that? Oh, you know what that is? You just put it on your pillow. Okay. Oh, All right, y'all. Y'all, y'all, y'all acting like y'all wasn't a thing, but y'all definitely, something's going on here. For sure, for sure. And let me know, because, you know. I mean, I already told you there was something going on. Wait. Natalie. So there is, you told me, I told you like in the car, you told me. Let me talk to you. Let me talk. Okay. Hold on one second, Frank. Let me talk to you. Okay, that's right. So you told me that, you know, y'all wasn't really doing anything like that. So like, what is it? I mean, just I'm just tell the audience. I don't know if you want me to cut or not. Cause like, I can cut the footage. Like, you know what I'm saying? I don't know. I don't care if they know. Like, he's one person I would just never be ashamed of. Like, honestly. Oh my God. <laughs> you like, like him, like him. Well, so. I remember I told you we used to like date. Like yeah, but like I said, you downplayed the hell out of it. Mm, I didn't sure did. You still over here talking? Is this uh, Damn boy, they just walked away for a few seconds. Yes, a few seconds. Give them some best friend time. You've been all up on her this whole time. Give them some time to talk. Why are you all up on her ass? What are you doing? <laughs> I was just talking to my best friend. Oh, okay. I'm just saying, y'all just, you know, I'm here too. So. Okay. I feel oh, you, bro. Calm we'll down. Hold on, bro. Chill out. Nah, he was, just, he was just saying, like, don't forget about him. But, like... But y'all been forgetting about her, though. Hold on now. Like, now he's being rude. He's definitely he's being rude. Yeah, he's I'm definitely being rude. He's so sensitive. That's what I love about him, though. It's like, you know, you know... So now you're picking his side. 
Ooh, you're getting your best friend upset. Look at, look at Easy. Look at her eyes right now. It looks like she's about to cry. <laughs> so now you're choosing sides, and that's a big no-no. You done fucked up. Anyway, so I used to um, be in like a relationship with him. Bro, why didn't you tell me? Because now I feel like a third wheel. For real? You no, know, because I didn't expect it, like the flames to come back like this. Like okay. honestly, right. well, it's just it feels it feels like it used to. Okay, all right. Well, we'll just, we'll you just get it in there. Yeah, no, we keep rolling. Just I mean, we'll title this and Natalie reunites with her boyfriend instead of a vlog. <laughs> you sound a little. <laughs> Damn. Well, so you don't talk about y'all? So you don't talk about? Uh, I want to buy some shoes so bad. Oh, yeah, we gotta save, 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 save. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> don't be a party member. Yeah, but like, I don't need no more. I don't spend no more money on shoes. Straight like shoes that. Is fresh, though. Oh, oh, I mean, stop it. My best friend bought me these. Okay. Christmas. You know, <laughs> I mean, get the shoe can. Get the shoe can. Hold on. Look at him. This the Balenciaga. Yeah, I like that. You know what I'm saying? You know what they say? <laughs> what do they say? How would you know that's what they say? You know what they say, bro. How do you know what they say? Bro, what, what do they say? You see, easy, like Natalie. Nat, check them. Check them now before I check them. <laughs> this, is, this is your friend, this is your ex. You better check them. She won that real quick. What do they say? I'm gonna get some big We're gonna look at your pinky. Come on, let's go. Let's go. You know that's it. You're good. You good? And this is what usually happens when you bring a straight man around a lesbian stud. I promise you. I promise you. This has happened to me many times. They bring up their macho-ness, you know what I'm saying? They want to show who's got the ball, who's got the real balls. They're intimidated. For whatever reason, I don't know if like lesbian studs have been taking their girls because that's a possibility. Uh, I mean, give me a reason. Give me a reason why straight men are like this around lesbian studs because I feel like that's the reason why. And they just get intimidated, so they gotta, they gotta put you on the spot, put you on blast, try to show you who's got the real balls. Like, boy, you better be quiet. Yeah, I'm good. Like, it's, it's, it was just playing. Like, it was, it was That's right. He was joking. Oh, it was <laughs> Hey, you wanna know something? 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 Him laughing like that, that would piss me off more. So beautiful. Oh my. Yes. So beautiful. <laughs> there y'all go. <laughs> there y'all go. <laughs> it's Yo. Like beautiful sometimes. <laughs> That's right, I tell you you're beautiful all the time. Yeah, but you don't say it like how I say it. With some bass. Okay. With some right, bass. <laughs> See? That's what I'm trying to tell you. He's trying to show, he's trying to show Easy who's got the real balls. Why are you intimidated? Why are you trying to compete? For what? For what? What does that accomplish? Absolutely nothing. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, I mean, it's just a little different because when you say it, I feel like it's more my like... Child. Well, I'm gonna You're say... You're beautiful, Mario. Bro. <laughs> Calm down. Chill out. Yo, he's been throwing shots all day, alright? <laughs> well, whatever. But yo, it is kind of... It's, it's, it's breezy over here. It is. I'm kind of cold. Yeah, that's why I told you. I knew I knew it was gonna be cold over here. I told you being a bigger jacket, you got a crop top. Look at this crop top. You don't you know, first of all, that's a hoodie. You don't need to take your hoodie off. Best friend, you can just take my jacket, you know, take my jacket. Yeah, I can best friend. I can literally just wear my jacket. This is too much. Oh, so now they're going to the corner. Now they're gonna talk. Oh, here we go. I don't know what is going on, honestly. Like they have been button heads all day, super awkward. Now they're going to have a private conversation. Sums up. What are you bro? doing, yo? What, okay. are you, what are you doing? Doing what, you bro? You see me over there trying to do my thing. You like, like, what are you, you cop blocking? Bro, how With no I, cop. First of With no cop. See? What did I tell you? What did I tell you? I speak from experience as a lesbian stud being around straight men. This is what happens to me. What did he say? Let's rewind that back. I'm trying to do my thing, you like, like, what are you, you cock blocking? Bro, bro how no I... You cock blocking with no cock. 
So they get intimidated. Like, listen, ain't nobody trying to sleep with your girl. Don't get, don't feel like you're in competition here. What did I say? Cop. First of all, no cop. Bro, calm down, no, bro. You're not a man, dog. Hold on, nobody, I'm not trying to be a man, bro. You Ain't just nobody. Me disrespectful me rude right now. I Ain't nobody trying to be a man. Just because we dress in these clothes does not mean that I want a pee pee. <laughs> A penis, a dick, whatever you want to say, in between my legs. Fuck no, I love my woman body. Okay, I love being a female. Ain't no lesbian stud trying to be a man. Unless you're trans. And easy ain't, ain't trans. Honestly, like, if you're trying to, like, get back with my best friend or whatever, this is not the way to do it. I'm you like best friend. No, I don't like yeah, you it, bro. Do. Bro, you're you been being... trying to get an alley forever, man. Bro, I don't Let want Let me her. do me, please. Let the man be in the man's spot. Bro, don't disrespect it ain't, there's me. No, there's no place for you. Don't. Hold it's on. Not for you. you being disrespectful. It's not for you. It's I'm not, not for you. Sure. Okay, guys. This has been fun. This is a problem. This is a problem. Easy needs to have a private conversation with Natalie because now her ex is not only being disrespectful, but he's also being disrespectful towards her sexuality. And that's something you don't play with. Natalie needs to check him. Either check him at the door or check him right now if you want him to be in your life. Because if he's going to be like that towards your best friend, that got to think about it. Hi. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, I guess we're going to sign out. Um, All right, easy gang. You know, this was fun. I got to take to my car real quick. Oh, yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah, I guess. I mean, where is it at? Is it far? No, he said it was the next row. Do you I'm care? Yeah, you it's up to you. Okay. We'll take you. Alright, bro. You know, we'll take you. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, bro. Where's your car? Oh, I'm gonna miss you. I miss you too, Shadow. <laughs> Which way do I go, bro? Dang, I feel like it's been too long since we've seen each other. Yeah, yeah. I know. I know. We gotta do better and hang out more. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> what are you doing? No, now, what are you doing? Damn. Bro, y'all are doing the most, bro. <laughs> bro, where's your car, bro? She became their chauffeur. Again. Again. By the way, we all know that they, that their pranks are skits. Most of them. Every now and then, I'm not sure if one is or not. Like this one here. I really think that Easy is not in on it. I do believe that Natalie and him are acting these things out, okay? But I'm really not sure. Either way, this is real life, you guys. This is real life when it comes to being a lesbian stud, okay? I'm just telling you my experiences. Bro? Regardless, I'm going about this reaction as if this whole thing is real, okay? Because it's from what it seems like, Easy's reaction to all this bullshit, it looks realistic. Oh, Jesus, yo, how, how straight am I gonna go? Uh, straighter than you. <laughs> oh, you got Stop! Why are you so funny? No, my, my bad. Just, 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 just. All right, bro, bro. Can you please tell me? Okay, I can't go any straight. Like, I'm gonna oh, fall off nah, the car. Come on, easy? God damn, bro. What are you talking easy. about? I'm trying to do something back here. Bro, I talking to who you talking to I know you ain't talking to me I know you are not talking to me this is when easy you have to pull over kick this motherfucker out of your car and if Natalie wants to go too she can go okay hi you, you got one we don't crack again bro what are you bro you're being disrespectful where's your car you can get out and walk for all I care mm. so now I gotta get out and walk yeah bro you can get you out and walk out the car. I you were supposed to be home. bro get out the car bro you're being rude you're being rude oh my Goodness, bro. guys. Bye. Bro. Come on, what? Obviously, you want to talk about something. Talk about you. What do you, you mean? Want to talk about Natalie again, bro. What you, bro, I don't care, bro. Oh, oh shit. Are you serious? What are you trying to do? Oh, it's going down, y'all. What the? Bro, why are you being that's why I say this is a skit because in real life I don't think Natalie would have stayed in the car while this was going on because this seems pretty heated so I think he is in on it that's what I believe
Be with her, bro. But you can't, you can't disrespect your best friend. You, you're not gonna be with her. You ain't got a dick, easy. Bro. Let it go. Bro. Let it go. Bro. Let it go. See, I told you it was a prank. I told you it was a prank. I told you. I told you. I told you. I'm good. I'm good at this. I'm telling you I'm good at this. I knew him and Natalie. See, man, I'm telling you, I know how to read people. I just do. That was good, though. I wasn't even upset, though. You were? <laughs> you were pissed, girl. You were pissed, but you had every right to be. I'd be the same way. So wait, who was this? What is this? First of all, let's start here. Let's start here. They weren't even dating. They weren't even dating in real life. They're probably just friends. Frank and I never have dated. Ever. Wait, what? No, we never dated. We were friends when I first moved out here, but we literally never dated. Bro. No. You ain't gonna get with him like this, bro. Mm. Yeah, he really is a rude gentleman. That, that's a rude gentleman. Great actor. Good job. You did good, though. I'm done. I'm done. I'm no, done. no. He did a good job. There was a couple moments where she was like exaggerating things a little bit too much, but he, like, that's why I was I wasn't able to tell in the beginning because he played it off very well. First of all, this is payback. For what? For that. I didn't see that one. I had to let it breathe a little bit. I didn't even want y'all to know what I was doing until the end. But this has been a whole prank. A whole prank. So you know what? Find us out. And actually, first Ooh. of all, shout yourself out. Shout yourself out. Oh, shout yourself out. You deserved it. Rude gentleman on social media. I would never disrespect you. My girl right here. Yeah, well, okay. He didn't know what to say, guy or girl. <laughs> That's okay. No offense taken. But yeah, man, he did a great job. So his name is Rude Gentleman. I'm gonna have, I'm gonna have to look him up. I hope he's got a, a YouTube channel. He's usually sweet. He's so nice. <laughs> he's a good guy. All right, y'all. If you guys are new to our channel, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button. Turn on post notifications off. You guys gotta make sure you watch the video all the way through so you don't miss those game trivia questions and win those cash prizes. I guess we out. Neasy gay, gay, gay. I love y'all. We out. <laughs> <laughs> she was sweating. She was sweating. That was a awesome video. It's been a while since I've seen a really good video because you know a lot of these videos have been a little bit eh. But I'm trying my best to react to them. But this one right here was a good one. Good job, ladies. All right, you guys. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Please hit that bell so you can get notified every time I upload. See you in the next video. Peace.